Rank 13 on the European ladder. Let's play some games. Let's go. First match versus 6.4k MMR Prodas player. It's been a while since I did some like top grand master games. I uh, like initially I wanted to do Void Ray uh, Disruptor episode today as I was trying to record, but there were a lot of issues trying to log into a Battle.net account and I think I might have suspended my account without uh, like without being able to log in at least for today. I did ask for like a verification code and stuff like that, but it just never came. And I think I might have tried to log in too many times, so I just couldn't access the account after all. So it, uh, this account was, the, my main account was the only account that I was able to uh, log into. So might as well just try to record some uh, hi super high level games, well the highest possible level of games in the Grandmaster. Currently rank 13, like we could see in the beginning of the video and Looking forward to play some just good old top level games, you know, like I've been doing challenges. I just finished Adepts Only to Grandmaster uh, yesterday at the day of recording that, of course. So yeah, it's, it's it's it will feel nice to play some actually normal games without any restrictions whatsoever. Maybe it will be a bit crazy. I'm not really sure if this is going to be a top Grandmaster games or some cheesy games. We'll see what the, what the games will bring and I'll see how I'll be able to label the the episode all in all it is a top grandmaster uh, games kind of uh, game at the very least and right, this guy is going for a double gateway of course i am doing the double gateway as well i could try going for probably stargate it's a very popular stargate map and i've been trying to think of a of a new style in pvp but for for that to uh, to work, I need to get get my geysers up a bit faster. This guy is not making a second pylon in his main base. Target is usually good versus that. But I think what I want to do instead, since I didn't really mine a lot of gas, target is very gas heavy. I think I'll just go for Fallout Council and Blink as a response. I think that's what I want to do. Of course, I will not go for a pylon on the low ground now. It, it would be way too risky. Let's go here. He's still not making any warp gates, so this gives me an idea this could be a Stargate proxy, actually. And I think going for a Twilight Council here is not a bad choice. Versus a proxy Stargate, it would have, I think it would make a lot of sense. The only problem I, I will be facing now is I will probably not be able to scout the proxy before it's like already a unit out, you know? Like if it's a proxy target, I'll probably not see the target before the oracle's out. Oh, never mind, never mind. Perfect positioning here for me. Fantastic. Uh, well, now I can either make a macro game out of this or kill him. I think I am very likely to kill him. Oh, there's two stalkers now. Uh, since he's going for, with stalkers, I think. I'll go blink. I can trade the stalkers here. Okay, I won the fight as well. That's really nice. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to... Oh, yeah. I don't think I'll be able to defend myself uh, from from the oracle popping out. Not, not necessarily defend, but like, uh, stop him from the oracle popping out. But at the very least, I can... Oh, no. Uh, oh, my God. Are you serious? I'm gonna take this much damage? That's a bit awkward. Oh, this is very awkward, guys. Yikes. Oh, that's a... That's a lot of damage to be getting there. Okay, well, we killed the battery. He didn't cancel that. Hmm. Still the orc here. He's not really running low on... Er oh, uh, he's not really running low on energy. Hmm. They keep pushing with the stalkers here. I feel like the right thing to do now. No. Four stalkers versus four stalkers, though. Okay, he has a battery on the high ground. That's a bit awkward. We'll have to defend the natural base. I will have blink soon. Oh, there's the oracle still lurking around. Of course it is. He's gonna have six stalkers now himself. That's a bit of a of an issue for me. I have Link now. Yeah, I do. Let's go. Oh. 
It's very good for me. Hello? Why am I losing probe? I can go. Uh, I, I cannot go here anymore. Okay, I think we lost uh, an equal amount of probes now. I saved all of my stalkers though, which is uh, the greater good. However, he still has the oracle around, so this is not an ideal situation. I would love to catch the oracle with this set of stalkers. I think it's, it will be possible. He should be maneuvering around. Ah, but I just blinked. I just blinked. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. If I didn't blink, it would have been a bit better. Well, I have 10 stalkers. I think I can move out. 10 stalkers is the magical number to one shot stalkers of your opponent. The problem is that my stalkers are a little bit wounded. It's not an easy snipe without losing stalkers. He will have blinks soon as well, I, I would guess. Mm. I'll try. I'll. Oh. oh, oh, this is good for me. Oh, this is very good. Oh, well, he has blink. It's still Oracle. He's blinking back now. He doesn't want to use the battery overcharge. Or maybe he doesn't have battery? Uh, sorry, he doesn't have energy, maybe? Not sure. Well, we can get a third base. Okay, that was good. He still has an oracle around somewhere. We need to keep that in mind. Let's get a forge now. This is looking good. I think this is looking good for us now. Mm, actually, I need. I should have uh, warped an additional gateways before the forge. I wonder if he's going for DTs. Because he had a lower amount of stalkers. And considering I really... Oh... Unlucky. Unlucky, my friend. Oh, we are in danger. Well, I guess the key is we are not, really. I'll put an observer here in this scenario. Okay. I really like my position now. I feel like I'm controlling the game. Now, the problem is probably going to be him moving out of the stalkers. And I don't know if, he, if he's like all in or not. I think he wants to take a third base. I don't think he's in an, in an all in position. I have a good observer uh, positioning as well. Oh, DTs? No, it's a probe. I think he's thinking about DTs. Oh, there's a proxy pylon. It's quite late, isn't it? I think he's really thinking about DTs. I'll let him do that. I'll let him warp in. I think that's very good for me. If he warps in DTs. Of course, this could be just a proxy pylon for like adepts or reinforcements. Doesn't necessarily have to be DTs. But I really think it is. Yes, yes, yes. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, it's so perfect. The bait worked. The bait worked perfectly. Exactly what I need. I think he might even GG now. Oh, he's here. Uh, well, he tried. He tried, guys. He's out of position now. The DTs were a big gamble. That didn't really work out for him. He still has not the mining third base. Oh, we're so much in control of this game. Hello. Oh, well. Uh, I should back off here. He's gonna chase these stalkers, probably, no? So I can maybe go here, okay? Okay, let's go, let's go. Yeah, chase me, chase me. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yes, chase me more. That's exactly what I wanted. He's gonna recall, isn't it? Yeah, I really need a fourth though. Oh, what? That's an immortal I didn't really expect. Woo. Okay, that's a bit annoying. I have a lot of uh, money. That uh, micro really cost me a lot. <laughs> I have the upgrade advantage. I can still make an immortal myself. Uh, it's not so bad. I really would like to get a fourth base down. I mean, he still has DTs, right? So I need to respect that uh, potential. No observers from his side. Let's pick a cannon here as well. I'll make some uh, sentries to force field out. Force field out his uh, immortals if he's going to be moving out with them. I think I need to retreat. He's gonna make an observer now. There's no way, right? I kind of know what he's doing already, so I'll back off. I have a lot of gateways coming up. If I just unsupply block myself, this should be very good, I think, for me. Transfer these, these probes to the fourth. He still has DTs, he still has only three gases, or well, four gases soon. Finally on supply blocking. My, I feel like my supply block has been like forever now. 
Alright, that's okay. We're through. Oh, he gets my observer. That's really annoying. I wonder if he has a hidden base. I don't think he does. I'm having charge soon. That's good. I need a fifth now as well. I think. I mean, I don't need it, but I can have it. Like, he cannot really stop me from getting a fifth, I think. I would really like to see if he's moving out or not. I feel like I need an observer. Because I want to, like, uh, attack with my zealous to his main base. Wait, is he moving out? He's not moving out, is he? Hmm, he should be. I think he's... Oh, he's taking a fourth. Okay. So we're gonna go here. We're gonna cancel his fourth at the same time. Attack the third base with the stalkers. And then warp in at the same time in his main base with the observer. Uh, defending the zealots. Okay. That's the plan. Let's go. Here we go. Fourth base first, I think. Let's go. He's kind of boosting out the forge. Oh no. Oh, I will be late. No. Oh, that, I don't like this. I don't like this for myself. Let's just get the cancel on the fourth. That would be lovely. Okay. This base is under attack as well. Yeah, I like this much more. He's recalling. I defended, but that was not perfectly done. He reacted super quickly to the zealots. I still think I'm fine here. I can recall this. Yeah, I think he's in, to in too much trouble. And this could have been done a little bit better by me. But it's still okay, I think. He's barely mining now. I'm on five bases. But I need to mine uh, from the 5th base. So it doesn't matter if I have a 5th base if I'm not uh, having any probes there. Okay, we need to start trading a bit. Because I have higher economy, so there's no reason for me not to try to trade with stalkers. Mm, I need additional gas. I'm only on 3 gases, surprisingly. I don't know why, how that happened. And I was still able to defend... Uh, to... How should I say it? Uh, invest into all the upgrades. A kill, not a cancel. GG. Okay, I'm gonna guess 140 supply for my opponent. 142. That was so close, wasn't it? Perfect call. Plus two, plus two. I have plus one armor done. Soon to be plus three. Even if he takes this base, I'm coming around to the zealots. That was a very good game by me. Even though the beginning with the oracle harassment really didn't work in my favor. If we take a look at the resource collection rate, look at this. I was quite behind in the early game. We have a rematch versus the same Protoss. I do believe this is strange, the Russian Protoss, I think. Even though it's a barcode, you can kind of feel the uh, the game. I think it is him, but I'm not 100% sure. Let's see how this game is going to go. Well, I certainly hope this is not going to be an only PvP episode. However, the previous game was quite fun to play with. I'm not gonna lie, that was quite fun. And I'm surprising I did so well. <laughs> I, I, I think I, a lot of the times I, I kind of like crumble under the situations uh, like the Oracle harassment. When like things go south for a moment, I, I, I tend to just lose lose the chain of, of the game, you know, like the rhythm, the tempo of the game. But in the previous game, I, I kept the tempo, which is really nice. I think this is not strange. Now that I think of it. But I don't, I don't know. I, never mind. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who that is. Doesn't matter. Let's just stick to the game. Stick to the entertainment here for you guys. Of course, if you enjoy the content, consider subscribing to my channel. I'm trying to grow my channel to the 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. That, that is my goal, and it'll be amazing too. To reach that goal. We're still quite a far away. We're like 7,300 subscribers, I think, at the time of recording this video. There's still a long way to go. Oh my god. But it's okay. As long as you guys are enjoying the content, that's fantastic. Uh, let's see what I can do against this Nexus. Can I be cheeky and aggressive? I can. But I'm a bit late for that. Mm, I'm not sure if I can do anything. 
I wonder. I'm, I'm just trying to process what, what I can do in this situation now. As this is a one gate expand with a nexus already down. And he has a probe in my base, knowing what I'm doing. I'll go adept. Whatever. Whatever. Let's see if I can make some harassment going. You gonna make a target or...? Not fully walling in though. I want to make a target myself. I don't want him to see this target though. I think he might be backing off now. Oh, nice. He's making. Oh, well, is it nice? I don't think it is. Hmm. Can I make an all in out of this? I, I don't like my situation now. My logistical situation. Well, he has a probe here. I can kind of block that. I know what I'm gonna do. Look at this, look at this. I'll, I'll try to block the, the wall off here. Look at this, he cannot make a pile on here. Come on! Come on! Yes, exactly! Oh, that is so perfect! <laughs> that is so good. Okay, he has an adept recall. That's a lot of damage. It's not really game over though. But it is very bad for him. No, I could have probably went back. He still has an oracle on the way. I don't have my nexus up. It's a bit annoying. Mm, I'll be able to warp in though. Let's just get a third base. Oh, can he do something here? Really? Oh, it's good micro. I'm still quite far behind, I think. Well, am I though? I have an oracle on the way. Maybe it's not so bad. He's making a phoenix. I think he's so... I have a... Stargate? Why is he making a phoenix? That's very odd. Very, very odd. Can I do something? Uh, any kind of damage now? With the oracle. A little. Support. Making a fortress already. Okay, we can recall this guy. That's good. Yeah, I think we're kind of controlling the game. That's fine. Warping again. Warping a stalker. I, I don't want to attack now. Let's just. Uh, can I recall? I'll have to kill this and kill the phoenix here. Oh, this is perfect. Oh, this is absolutely perfect. That's my oracle. Oh, I need to transfer some of these probes. Yeah, the early game is going so much in my favor. Let's kill this other one. Be fantastic. Oh, he still has the oracle here. Uh, I think I can still move in, right? I can warp in here. I can kill a lot of probes here. It's kind of trapped. Let's warp in here. I don't have a Twilight Cancel though. GG. Oh, <laughs> perfect. Oh, that was so sick. Such sick micro. Especially, look at this. Uh, the, the Adept block was absolutely perfect. The, the reason why this game went so much in my favor is only because of this move. So what I'm trying to do is with this probe, this this red probe is trying to make a full wall off here, right? With a pylon whenever the adepts are coming. But because my probe is here, uh, he cannot make this pylon or a gateway here or anything to block off his uh, wall to make a full wall off because you cannot ma you cannot make buildings on top of your opponent's units. So because I'm buying myself the crucial three or four seconds with this probe, he cannot make a full wall off here. And the adepts get in, and then I get to do the critical amount of damage with these adepts. That was actually perfect. I'm so happy with that. That was perfect micro. Max packs to finish off the episode with three PvPs in a row. At least they, they were quite entertaining, at least from my side. I hope you guys enjoy the previous games as well. Let's see what we can do against Max packs here, though. He's been uh, winning a lot versus me recently. Max packs, that is, of course. And I was not able to break him. Like, I was able to pick off a couple of games against him. Here and there. But, like, most of the time, the finishing best of 
best of race or like the majority of the games, Max, Max, uh, Max Pax has been winning versus me. So it's time to take some revenge on the record here. Hopefully, probably, maybe, maybe not. He's still a very good player. He's actually impressively good in the past few months. Definitely having great results. A big shame that he is not competing in an offline event. Would love to see him uh, competing offline because for all the online greatness that he's doing, it's nothing compared to an offline greatness. Right, let's, let's see. It's definitely going to be a one gate expand. Of course it is. I'm gonna make a gateway here. We'll, we'll try to block the expansion for as long as I can. I think I'll start with Adepts. Again. Force my opponent into... Oh, really? Uh, he's gonna make a Nexus, isn't he? Oh, that's so lame. That's so lame. How does this even happen? We cannot play this like that. Okay. Is it... We'll try to make a micro battle then, huh? Let's do this. We'll just all in. Ah, I cannot make let him make a Nexus like that. We like we just need to try to break him. Let's see. Make or break, guys. He's really disrupting my mining, which is expertly done by him. Now, what I can do. Get myself a couple of stalkers. I think I can make a proxy gateway and a proxy robo here. Is possible? Should be good enough, I think. Let's just do it. Proxy gateway. We're gonna be not making a third pylon just yet. We need that uh, for the additional two stalkers. I think a robo to follow. I'm just gonna like completely yolo it, completely send it. No looking back. Complete all in. I'm gonna boost out the gateway. Uh, yeah, the warp gate, I should say. Make a robo now. I can make even batteries, but I don't think it's a good idea. Like this. I think get a fourth gateway, I don't think it's a good idea. Let's just make a pylon here. There's the adept, of course. Oh. Oh, I can get a battery here, I think, for free. Well, not necessarily for free, but you know. Minus one stalker. Actually, is this worth it? It might be. It just might be worth it. Is he making an oracle? It's a void way, I think. Let's try to interrupt him here. Void is already out. It's a bit annoying. Uh, well, we have warp gate on the way. It's on finishing. I will be able to warp in a substantial amount of stalkers. Now, the problem is I have stalkers on the way, but they are not there yet. Because this is not what I was planning to do. I think we can still try to break through. Let's see. He's gonna defend his base, of course. With the void right here. Let's go. Oh. We're still fighting within a battery overcharge. I think we might be able to break in here. This void is going to be annoying. Uh, we can fight here. I think we're doing this. Yeah, we can warp in another set. He only has an additional void ray, so there's nothing he can do. The robot actually was the savior here. Well, what you gonna do now, my friend? You have one void ray versus the amount of stalkers. And we own him this time. He was only preparing for a frontal attack. He didn't really take into consideration... Well, he did take into consideration the... Uh, the Robo. But he was not prepared for the move out. He was prepared for the move out in the main base, but he was prepared for the frontal attack. What a perfect set of games, everybody. We won every single game. <laughs> Maybe I'm actually good at this game. 
Maybe I am. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this set of games. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I wish you a pleasant rest of the day. Once again, consider subscribing if you enjoy the content. And I'll see you on the next episode of whatever I upload. I'm a PvP god. Actual PvP god. <laughs> Take care. Bye-bye.